There's an urgent need for research and treatment of Alzheimer's disease now. Currently, there are over 5 million persons in the United States suffering from the disease, which requires almost $200 billion a year to care for those individuals. And the number of persons with Alzheimer's disease is rising exponentially. We have focused our research on understanding the aging of the female brain because 68% of all persons with Alzheimer's disease are women. And so we asked the question, is it simply because women live longer or is it the way their brain ages? And our research has shown that it's really the way that the female brain ages that puts them at risk for developing Alzheimer's disease. The results of that research has led us to now understand when the brain is changing in the female with aging and strategies to intervene in that process to prevent the development of Alzheimer's disease. And in this case, specifically, we've developed an alternative to estrogen therapy that prevents the brain from switching over to the Alzheimer's pathway and keeps the brain on a healthy, vibrant aging pathway. This alternative to estrogen therapy is particularly important because it has the benefits of estrogen in the brain, but has no impact on the breast or the uterus, which can be a risk factor for hormone therapy. Our team is conducting scientific discovery and translating those discoveries into therapeutics to prevent and treat Alzheimer's disease. So we literally go from bench to bedside.